Everybody give it up for Mr. Andrew Smock. Hey, everybody. Let me keep this stand truck going. I see each and every six of you out of here. And the first is Bonds of Justice. That is uh, every single uh, every single one of the superheroes you know and love is now high. That's right. We got High Red Man because he's high. <laughs> we got we got the High Hulk. That, that's a combination of the High and the Hulk because uh, he's high and hulky. Uh, wait, someone shout out a shout out a superhero name. Who's your favorite superhero? Uh, Spider-Man. Spider-Man. man Done. Bam. <laughs> Let's get another one. Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Fuck. <laughs> Shit, hold on. Uh, Blunter Woman. Oh. Blunter Woman. There we go. Let's get another suggestion. Oh, Mary Fuck Kill. Zach Graff. Big Bird. Roseanne. Well, let me just first of all say, you're never going to get another chance to fuck Big Bird. <laughs> okay? Look, there's some people that you can fuck like, you know, if I meet Roseanne on the street, you know, I could probably fuck Roseanne anyway. Any day. <laughs> like, we just got to do some nice talking up to her, right? Now, I could fuck Zach Rapp, you know, because he's... He's, we'd be cool, we'd grow down, you know, we're listening to some Dave Matthews or whatever the fuck he listens to. Suddenly we're giving each other hand jobs. I can fuck Zach Brad, but then we got, we have charm personality. I think there would be chemistry there. So let's fuck Big Bird, first of all. That's all I want to say, because when are you going to fuck Big Bird again? You're not going to ever see Big Bird on the street. You are given an opportunity right now to fuck the shit out of Big Bird. And that's never coming back, okay? And if you, like, say you come on Big Bird, you just cost the production company a shit ton of money, one. They gotta dry clean the fuck out of Big Bird now. All right, so we got Big Bird out of the way. He's definitely the fuck. We're definitely fucking Big Bird. All right, so now we gotta, okay, kill Roseanne, obviously. <laughs> obviously. If we meet Roseanne on the street, let's not even try to fuck her. Let's not even try to fuck her. Let's go, because I can fuck her, I can kill her, okay? I'm not going to marry her. That one is taken care of. And I guess I get married to Zach Brad. But like, I, like I was kind of leading up to that before. Like, I think we'd get along really well. Like, we, we would be nice. We'd be a cute couple, I think. Me and Zach Brad. I'd have to kill his black friend. Um, <laughs> I, I just know, because you would have to kill because they're too close, right? They got that bro love. That's going to get in the way of what I really want, which is a long-lasting relationship with Zach Graff. Let's give another suggestion. Chisnado 2. That is okay. So think about it like this. You have a warm front of chiz <laughs> coming up from the south. Okay. A warm front of jizz coming right up here now. That would be okay on its own. That's nice because people like the warmer weather. Unfortunately, there is a cold front of jizz also coming down from the north. And they're gonna meet right here. Now, when the warm jizz and the cold jizz mixes, I don't know if you guys are well, uh, you know, well versed in weather. That's gonna tornado. Now, there's gonna be. You're gonna see first some jizz funnels up in the sky, and you're gonna think, is this is this is this gonna be a jizznado? Yes or no? Yes or no? Okay. This has only happened one other time. Okay. We don't just automatically assume it's gonna be a jizznado, but you never know, right? So, but the second thing is that suddenly jizz hail starts coming down, and you're like. Okay, shit could be getting real. This is this is jizz. Okay, and let me just press the business by saying I this is gonna be really gross jizz hail, okay? I once watched a porn where a chick ate a frozen jizz box popsicle. Don't judge me, but this is a real thing that happened and I watched. It's pretty gross. And that shit's falling from the sky, okay? The sky 
not as dark as you think. Not as dark. It's a very, it's very white up there, and suddenly it's just NATO. Yeah. Yeah, and your trailer park home, that shit's that shit is jizz. That is that is not going to, that is not gonna be fun. That's not a cleanup, you know? There's gonna there's gonna be news crews there, little children, they're gonna get the shots of the little child covered in jizz, just so much jizz, and they're crying and going, Mommy, mommy, I'm covered in jizz. And the jizz NATO, has anyone seen my mommy? They're like, no, your mommy drowned in jizz. <laughs> so much because okay, think, think about the physics of a gisnado for a second, okay? All right, a tornado that's wind, that's wind blowing around, shit is getting blown, right? A gisnado that's not air, that's jizz, okay? That is your jizz flying around at breakneck speeds. It's like 70 miles an hour jizz, okay? I'm gonna say the top speed I jizz is like, I don't know, I don't know, like maybe 20 miles an hour, okay? Like if I'm jerking off and there's a sprinter coming by and we like measured it, I think I may be matching a sprinter, maybe, but I don't got the force to keep going. This is a Gisnado, people! This is a Gisnado! That shit's going hard, that shit is 70 miles an hour jizz right in your face, okay? If you got hit by water going that fast, that shit would hurt. This is jizz. This is sticky. This is not a good situation to be in. I was getting my Mr. Let's not get over. We could. We need to do 10 more minutes. We? Okay. Thrash metal love song. It's called Love by Pantera. That already exists. Next. Yeah, I know my metal too well. Butt stuff is greater than love stuff. Let me think if I agree on that <laughs> Now, butt stuff is pretty... Okay, but you should have a, a smattering of both, okay? <laughs> you should have both... Your love stuff should include a couple fingers in there, right? Like, that's just... That's love to me, you know? You gotta... But butt stuff is greater than love stuff. Now, that, that though, is phrased like it's a math like fact, right? Like we're solving a math <laughs> equation now. What way? What would that be? What would that be? Where we have to go? All right. If butt stuff is greater than love stuff, where is uh, where is spankings in this? Is spanking considered <laughs> butt? Is that butt stuff? Is it, when does butt stuff occur? Is that just fingers? Is that like what? Is that only penetration? Like if you're smacking? So let's get another suggestion. This is going off the fucking rails. Revenge of the Sloth. Okay, so the Sloth, his home was destroyed in Giznado 2. <laughs> he was living, okay, so this, uh, in this movie, the, uh, this is actually, this is a sequel, this is a spinoff of Giznado 2, the movie. Uh, in this movie, uh, there's a Sloth, and he was, he was the pet. Of a uh, of a people that lived in a trailer home, they like shouldn't have had a sloth. They did. That's illegal. But they're white trash. So sometimes you get a sloth. Sometimes you buy a sloth. Okay. Uh, so they buy the sloth, and suddenly he doesn't have a house anymore. Thanks, Obama. Am I right? <laughs> Am I right? Yeah. Yeah. Where was FEMA during this? Huh? Where was FEMA during Gisnado Two? They weren't there. And Gisnado One. We should have known, we should have known that there needs to be an emergency plan for just NATOs. He dropped the fucking ball. He dropped the fucking ball. Fucking Obama. So this sloth is pissed off. Alright? And I don't know if you know when a sloth is planning revenge, he's in it for the long run, okay? Because he moves incredibly slow. He has to be. He has to keep. He keeps that fiery, burning passion in his brain at all times. And do you know how hard it is for a sloth to use a sniper gun? <laughs> do you know? Their hands are hooks. Their hands are hooks. Now they're good at climbing. So he gets up on top of the building real easy. Real easy. But he's got those hook hands. Now, there's the thing, the Secret Service, 
ain't gonna suspect a sloth, even a sloth with a high-powered sniper rifle. Who's gonna suspect? Like if I'm okay, say I'm a Secret Service guy, right? I'm looking up at the, I'm looking up on all the buildings, and I'm like, all right, there's a guy with a gun. Let's get the guy with the gun. Let's get that with the guy with the gun. Fucking sloth? <laughs> what is a sloth gonna do? Uh, fucking kill the president is what happened, and that's how the movie ends with the goddamn sloth coming out on top and kills a bum. And that's gonna be my time. 